and be comfortable from the moment I stepped in here. And the recovery center care has been top notch. Well, I actually just went on the website and searched several different facilities and uh, several different positions. And from the moment that I sent the email to Vita and the response time and the uh, just the interaction with the team here, I knew immediately that this was going to be a, a top contender for making my decision of where to get my surgery done. Um, first of all, I loved my virtual interview with Dr. Lucio. He was kind, personable, and he looked at my pictures that I provided and told me exactly what he felt I needed in addition to what I wanted or not wanted. And um, staying in contact with coordinators all throughout the moment I got here, I was not nervous. I was never um, apprehensive about surgery. They made me comfortable from the moment I stepped in here. And the recovery center care has been top notch. It's excellent. It, it's a blur. I, I hardly remember it for one thing. Um, it started early as always. Um, I was able to meet with Alejandro, Dr. Lucio's assistant, and Dr. Lucio himself. I felt absolutely confident in their care. Um, met with the anesthesiologist, everything that I would have expected and very kind and caring and took care of any questions or concerns that I had. So surgery was really, I, I wasn't that nervous. I have, it's been many years ago, I had a breast augmentation back in 2006. One of the uh, most painful elective surgeries I've ever done. So, and it was not like that this time. Oh, he's, he's a charm. He's, he's nice, he's considerate, he is um, patient-centric, um, very smart. He's been doing this for a long time um, and just trustworthy. One of the reasons why I chose Vita was because of the recovery services and having this recovery floor within the facility was important to me. Um, the nurses and staff here are very kind and caring and they're attentive to all of my needs and others. The food is wonderful. I feel like I was giving the right amount of food and protein that I need for my body to heal. And just the kindness is was excellent. I would definitely do that all over again. Stay, and I've been here seven days. I would do your research. Everybody needs to do your research. Um, and reach out to other patients that have had these procedures um, and watch YouTube and TikTok to understand what to expect. That really helped me look at their before and after pictures. Um, that was critical for me and I like Dr. Lucio's work for my body type. Um, so that was big for me. Be prepared to be uncomfortable for a while. I did, I did. Our driver was wonderful. He called me as soon as I was off the plane. He told me exactly where I needed to be. I also had that in my pre-op paperwork. So it was listed, it was clear to me where I needed to be. He reinforced that. He said, I'll be there in eight minutes. Eight minutes, he was there. Um, very, very nice. Got through customs without a problem across the border. So I look forward to seeing him on my way out. I wanted to come alone and I wanted to stay in the recovery area just because I knew I would get the care that I need here. Uh, and I had no problem being by myself. I made friends with other patients here. We would sit out in the uh, lounge area or go up to the fifth floor and spend some time together. So we would kind of share our, our uh, recovery stories. Uh, it, it, it was not, there was nothing that I was scared to be alone. I felt very safe the entire time. Um, it, again, there was, it, I had no apprehension of coming here alone.